We'll get a move on then. Let's get a move on and talk about a team that was facing one of the lesser known teams in the tournament. They were up against Canada, but Australia were actually sweating with a certain Hiral Patel making life very difficult for some of their best pacers, isn't it? But then overall, comfortable win for Australia or will you say they're looking a little dodgy and other teams will talk up their chances. They will actually look forward to playing Australia in the quarterfinals. Well, I think it was interesting. I mean, their, their bowlers didn't, didn't bowl particularly well in the first 10 overs and I think a lot of coaches will take a lot of heart from that. So, But uh, you know, they, they were always going to win, we knew that. But uh, I, I just think there's, the, the pace that they generate, especially if you play in a place like Bangalore where it's a, a good track, you know, a lot of people would fancy the, the ball coming on small ground. Mm. You, you never know. know. Two, two teams played, right? One got 82 of 10, one got 47. Did Australia get 82? <laughs> no, I think it was the one in red. It was no, Canada who got 82 for one. Count, so. That's right. Mike, <laughs> your view of the game, because we saw the way Canada put it out, yeah. they, they gave it all they had. They did. The, the trouble is, unfortunately, they haven't got the quality a little bit further down the order. And of course, when you've got three fast bowlers who, uh, who the guys would not have seen, they found it very difficult to cope with. And, and Ricky Ponting played it quite well. He, he kept the fast bowlers on, <coughs> certainly one of them at the same time. And, and the guys down the audience couldn't quite know very well. The, the, the Australian batsmen don't know how to play spin because they were dancing to Balaji's tunes. They were all at sea, especially Shane Watson, didn't know what, what was coming well, where. You see what kind of spinner they've got. Crazy, huh? I mean, geez. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be very disappointed and if you, you got your hands on the knot. And you haven't mentioned Smith yet. You can't and, and exactly. I think the best spinner is Michael Clark, by the way. So yes, I mean, you just think in these him. conditions. He, he yeah. has been the best spinner for quite a while, you know, for Australia. But Australia, for chance, India were to play Australia sometime later on in the we it will be three spinners team. and one pacer in the team. We take for team. India. No, yeah. but I think I think what the, today's match has exposed is that they have got a weak link. You know, mm -hmm. their, their bowling is susceptible. You put pressure on the seamers, the spinners are, are yeah. the weak link. So who are they going to fall back on? Against Canada, they had enough resources to come back and stifle them. You know, because the lesser teams will have one good period, but they will find it really hard to sustain it. In a long game, the good or better team will more or less eventually come back.